Covering Nassau County, we're learning more about a couple who died in a crash over the weekend and more about the man who police blame for the accident. 45-year-old Sean Blitchington is charged with felony hit and run, resulting in the death of three. 22-year-old Bailey McKnight, 21-year-old Ryan Kennedy, and their unborn son were all killed in the crash Saturday night. News 4 Jacks reporter Ashley Spicer is joining us live from the scene in Bryceville. Ashley. Tom, I'm live here along US 301 where Ryan Kennedy and his pregnant girlfriend Bailey McKnight were killed. Police say that Sean Blitchington hit them head on here crossing into their lane. Blitchington is in the hospital right now for a collapsed lung. After that, he's going to be taken to the Nassau County Jail and booked. This is 22 year old Bailey McKnight and 21 year old Ryan Kennedy. They were expecting a baby boy named Lawson. Bailey was eight months pregnant and had a three year old son from a previous relationship. We interviewed McKnight back in January for a story we were working on. This is video from that interview. This is her playing with her three year old son. That she leaves behind. We spoke to Bailey's cousin by phone. She tells us that Bailey's mother is devastated. Her daughter's death comes two years after the death of her son Bryce. Losing Bailey's like ripping off a band-aid of an old wound they now have to go through everything all over again yeah it's still and fresh it's still numb it's it's yeah. unbelievable we've learned more about the man charged in the deaths of the young couple and their unborn son these are mug shots from a few of blitchington's many arrests we also looked into his driving record Blitchington had a five DUI arrest. In 2002 in Duval County, he pleaded no contest and got probation. In 2003 in Duval County, another arrest, same plea and more probation. In 2004 and 2008 in Nassau County, same plea and same probation. And then in 2011 in Nassau County, he pleaded no contest to DUI and served 90 days in jail. Sissy Grady Kruger was friends with McKnight. Her daughter Haley was supposed to be at Bailey's baby shower this weekend. The last Last one, he got 90 days in jail. Mm -hmm. Do you think that was sufficient enough? No. No, not at all. He should have been taught a lesson, but he wasn't. Troopers say that Blitchington was driving without a valid driver's license. I spoke with Kennedy's father off camera. He was in tears and said he really couldn't say anything at this point to make it better. I was told that Ryan was his only son and this was to be his first grandchild. As for Blitchington, he faces a felony hit and run. And because uh, there's three people involved here, it's 30 years maximum that he could face times three. So a maximum of 90 years. I'm live Ashley Spicer, Channel 4, the local station.